Hello Pisces, thank you so much for joining me. Today I'm going to be doing a quick general reading for you for what's happening in the next 72 hours. If you'd like something personal, you can check out the description. More. Okay, so what's happening for Pisces in the next 72 hours? for Pisces the next 72 hours. Alright. It's going to be happening for Pisces the next 72 hours from when they're watching the video. Two of Swords, so um, a decision needs to be made. Someone's pondering over decision. Okay, show me more. It's happening in the next 72 hours for Pisces. You could be making a decision. Someone could be making a decision in regards to you. Uh, Nine of Pentacles, so this is a very independent energy. Uh, like stability and independence okay show me more for Pisces like 72 hours Queen of Swords yeah okay so making a decision speaking up on something could be about a queen of swords as well so uh libra gemini aquarius so yeah you could be having an air sign be making a decision about you someone could be also making a decision in work as well uh trying to decide between two options two paths Someone, yeah, someone wants clarity on making a decision. Okay. So someone's going to be pondering over decision in the next 72 hours. Has to do with someone's independence. So this could be about um, someone who is single. Someone who, also someone who works for themselves or someone's trying to make the decision to, wor to, to work for themselves or someone's trying to make the decision to be single, to be independent. Okay, show me more about the Two of Swords. Father of Cups. Okay, so it could be another water sign or it's a masculine um, water energy that's trying to make a decision. Okay, show me more about the Nine of Pentacles. Um, someone's emotions could be getting in the way of a decision. Show me more about the Nine of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles. Yeah, so someone's unsure about something. Someone's unsure about what the best option is for them. Okay. And show me more about the Queen of Swords. Uh, eight of Wands, so communicating something. Fast forward movement towards something, and then we have the Four of Pentacles, which tried to come out before uh, towards something st stable. Stable, okay. So this is a lot about making a decision about something. Someone's very unsure, emotions could be getting in the way. And then there's a Queen of Swords communicating something about stability or about a foundation or about someone feeling stagnant so someone could be making a decision um, this could be in career or someone's making a decision to go off and work for themselves or yeah that's kind of what it's what it's feeling like so then someone's communicating 
the fact that they either feel stuck where they are or they just feel like they can't grow where they are. Someone's communicating that to you or you're communicating that to the Queen of Swords. Queen of Swords could be like a boss too. That's kind of what I'm feeling too. Okay. So, um, what, what is Pisces deciding on or what is this person deciding on? Ooh, the moon. Yeah, what I'm feeling with, with the moon is like going towards something that's a dream. You could, this could be something that you kind of hide from people or something or that someone hides from people that they have the dream to go towards something, but um, they keep that hidden. There could be some heart chakra stuff tied to it or something like that, or maybe even like solar plexus chakra stuff tied to it. You might want to do meditations in that. If this is you who's scared to go towards something or scared to live out a dream, or scared to reveal a dream. Not scared, but holding back from doing so for egoic reasons. And uh, what's the other option? Also, the dream is also unknown as well. There's a, that aspect where the possibilities are unknown. You could stay where you know it works, or you know you can have what you've had or you can move towards something that you don't really know how it's going to turn out but it's a dream for you uh show me more <laughs> ace of pentacles yeah new beginning in finances so someone could um someone could be trying to decide to go somewhere else and then they're off their the job that they're trying to leave offers them something to get them to stay So someone's unsure because they're trying to offer you a pay raise because you've communicated that you feel stagnant, you know, you don't feel like there's enough growth. So they're like, okay, well, you know, we can look at giving you a raise. That's like the type of energy that I'm getting. So then it kind of adds to your confusion. That could be why we have the two of swords here. And then we also have the two of pentacles here. Like, someone could have already even tried to start something on their own, and then their job commun communicates with them that they want to offer them more. Also, someone could be doing, someone could be doing that. They, they leave a job and they go towards a dream. They choose to do that. And then there's an opportunity that someone's unsure of again. So why is, what is causing so much, um lack of clarity for Pisces or whoever this is in regards to Pisces whoever I may be speaking about um nine of wands so reflecting on past events or how things have gone in the past um yeah someone someone's the way someone's reflecting on something is causing a, lo a lack of clarity so what can help um Pisces have more clarity. What would help Pisces have more clarity? Wow, <laughs> we have the Nine of Pentacles again. So going towards um, the, your independence, really. <laughs> because you that that's what feels right to you. That's kind of what I'm feeling. That's what you want to do. Okay, and yeah, what else should um, Pisces stay focused on for the most high vibrational timeline possible with this? Wow. We have the Ten of Pentacles, and then we have the High Priestess. So follow your intuition. Also, you could have had a specific vision of um, a space and the potential that it could hold. And um, it's saying to stay focused on that. And yeah, your intuition, your dreams, your visions, how you see this space unfolding. There's a reason that you envision it that way. That's kind of what I'm feeling. 
Um, so yeah, thank you Pisces. I hope that if this resonated with you, that this gave you some clarity or guidance on something that you're going through or going to be going through, and best of luck going through it. Bye!